Now on the screen, you can see the activity configure Cisco routers for SIDLOG, NTP, and SS8 operations. And so as objectives for these activities. And there is a background or scenario for this activity. You should read it carefully before configuring. Now on part one, we will configure OSPF MD5 authentication. Firstly, we test connectivity between PCs. Now I test the connectivity between PCC and PCA. It's successful. And from PCC to PCB, it's successful too. Next, we will configure OSPF MD5 authentication for all the routers in area 0. We configure the same way with router 2 and router 3. As you can see, the router had established the neighbor connection. And now we will configure the password. And I copy this command and paste it into router 2 and router 3. After configuring, we will show the OSPF interface and see the result. As you can see on the router 1, on the interface serial 000, we can see that the message Digest authentication is enabled with the key ID is 1. We should verify router 2 and router 3 for OSPF MD5 authentication. With router 2, we will check for the 0000 and 0001. 